hey guys good morning i hope you're all doing well welcome back to my channel thank you so much for always coming back to watch my videos in case you're new here welcome my name is Dee Mwango from Kenya that is Mama Africa and welcome to Jamaica the land that we all love so in case it's our very first time here please be sure to subscribe road to a half a million subscribing is free of charge you need no money you need nothing but just to press the subscription button because we want to get a half a, mi a half a million, right? So please do so. And if you are a returning subscriber, you're already subscribed. Thank you so much. You mean the world to me. So guys, I don't know, but I'm feeling so grateful. I thank God. Just being alive, being of good health, feeling so good like oh god's grace has been sufficient and uh it's almost christmas <laughs> but for me i already began my christmas season because why not trust me in my entire life i've never like i've never been in this christmas mood that i am in right now here in jamaica i just don't know christmas in jamaica feels like christmas in i don't know where christmas in heaven <laughs> so i'm just so happy i love jamaica jamaica is that one country that i just don't know what to say i love this country i'm exactly where i'm supposed to be adding weight you guys you can all see my face is round like a dumpling glowing feeling good if you're not following me on instagram you're missing a lot please go follow me d muango official so that you can see my daily pictures and updates all right so welcome to jamaica the land that we all love and if you've never been to jamaica you're missing out trust me you're missing out so much everybody in a lifetime needs to come to jamaica so if you're watching having travel plans to come to jamaica please don't hesitate all right anyway guys without uh further ado we are in hanover and um i'm so excited because um yesterday we arrived where i am coming live from and let me show you around so basically this is where i'm calling home you guys as you all see when i say jamaica is beautiful you all can see how beautiful this country is so let me put on my shoes so that i can take you along okay so this is where i'm calling home for now i'm so so excited you guys i don't know where to begin from so basically this is where i'm calling home you guys my guys when i say jamaica is beautiful Jamaica is beautiful that and that's what I exactly mean and I mean my words so guys finally here we are and OMG I don't know if you guys I really don't know if you guys are ready so let's start from the outside so this is how it looks like you can come here relax have a good time like wow the setting it's just something else so this is basically somewhere to chill during the day having a glass of wine just name them and i love this this is so creative guys what do you think let me know so let's go in the house guys welcome to this beautiful space honestly Kino made me say yes big yes yeah man this is the life this <laughs> is the life and woo, you guys, look at how beautiful it is. So you have this. In Jamaica, they call it seti. <laughs> if you're not Jamaican, mm -hmm. if you know, you know. So this is beautiful. I love it. This is the living area. I just love how everything blends in. The seti is so comfortable. I, I just love it. It's a 10 out of 10 minus nothing. And I love how they pay attention to the details. This is so Instagrammable. For those who know what I mean, look at that. Woo very 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 instagrammable the curtains match with the seats match with the deco like what else can you ask for personally i'm so so much impressed what do you guys think let me know in the comment section down below and now we have the big tv and d mwango is on the mix and um yeah all right guys when you're watching not skipping ads so basically if you haven't subscribed please go subscribe D Mwango on YouTube and also check out Kino Life in Jamaica. Okay, because it's Kino who coordinated all this. Mm -hmm. I had no idea. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Kino is the best. 
trust mm. me so mm. he's the reason behind all this i had no idea at all at all so this is the dining area i love the details i love everything just let me know what you guys think but to me i want to give them a 10 out mm -hmm. of 10 the tv is big enough the details everything is just something else then we also have the di uh the dining area right here when i first came in i was like yo d it's about time you need a holiday home for yourself girl like i'm so motivated i even lack one so let to explain guys look at the lights like i love every detail and the fact that they pay details to everything that's mind-blowing this is the beach it's a walking distance to the beach but just because we arrived here a bit late I'll be taking you there tomorrow. Maybe you wanna go do some workouts because you know, Jamaica is giving me so much love and I appreciate it now I'm gaining weight. And you all can see, but I'm so happy. So I can't wait to show you how the beach looks like tomorrow. So this is the dining area basically and I love it. I love everything. This is so creative. So let me know what you think about it in the comment section down below. We proceed to the kitchen and wow. They really know who D is. Today, if you watched Kino's uh, video, you'll see I ate 14 <laughs> bananas <laughs> even before I paid. Mm -hmm. I love bananas. Like, I'm a huge lover of bananas, as you all see. So we have plantain chips, we have nuts, we have everything. And welcome to the kitchen. Ooh, so the good thing is Kino is here. Kino is a good chef. And I'll be cooking some good chapatis as well. And he'll be making the beans. So... This is beautiful. So this is the cooker right here. Very clean as you all see. I just love the whole setup of the kitchen, guys. It's just so, so beautiful. I love it to have all the dishes here, wine glasses. Everything that you're thinking of is here for you. Everything, you know. We have the sink, clean water, of course, as you all see, guys. Very clean. And we still have more on this side. Extra plates. We're just two people here. <laughs> So this is more than what we can ask for, you know, and we have the complimentary, we have sugar, we have everything. Wow, this is so sweet of, of her. We have the coffee maker, we have the toaster, we have, we have everything that you can ever ask for in the kitchen. And this fridge, wow, well, I think when I go home, I need to get my mom one of these because we've never ever have had a fridge before. And it's because when you live in the countryside, you really don't need a fridge because we eat fresh food. We don't keep anything. Okay. It's from the farm to the mouth. Oh. Repeat every day. Every day. Yeah. So mm -hmm. guys, welcome and damn you guys. Look at that. Hey, this place belongs to part of Team D and you guys are just excellent. Mm -hmm. She knows I love the jelly and look mm -hmm. what I found. Three of them. Big ones, fresh, well mm -hmm. chill or cold in the fridge, and there's some red stripe here for Kyo. Mm -hmm. I remember yeah. she's one of our subscribers. You know? uh -huh. So, this is so beautiful, guys. I love it. Out of 10, 10 out of 10 minus nothing. We have some deco on the wall. God bless the food before us, the family besides us, and the love between us. Team D, mm -hmm. amen. But, D, look, one thing you never check out. The bin. Uh -huh. Oh, this reminds me of uh, mm -hmm. Kino was just eating some, some what? Water some crisps. crisps. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So this reminds me, which country was this? I was traveling, I think it's in Europe, and I found the same thing, and I was like, wow. <laughs> <laughs> you don't wow, have to look touch at it. That smart bin. Smart bin. <laughs> Whoops. Smart. Hey, this place is pure luxury, mm -hmm. as you all see. She went out of her way. I love it. Did I show you guys the lights? Wow, this is beautiful. So guys, welcome to the laundry where I love more than the kitchen. Mm -hmm. So every day when I'm shopping, I have to shop for some laundry detergents. So here is the laundry room. Look how spotless it is. If you mm -hmm. clean, you can notice this place is extremely clean, clean, spotless. So we have the washer, we have the dryer. Same time. So this is the laundry room. And this, lo this door leads to the outside. So I'll show you that tomorrow. But wow, I'm so much surprised. Mm -hmm. I'm so surprised. This is beautiful. We have the basin here. You can wash the clothes that you feel like. They can't go in the washing machine. Let me know your thoughts. Personally, I'm out of words. Honestly, mm -hmm. that's what I can say. So now, now, I don't know if you guys are ready. <laughs> 
So now I want to take you to the bedrooms. And remember, we have two bedrooms, mine and Kino's. So mm. if you watched, if mm. you watch, or if you have already watched Kino's video, video, you'll mm. see what we did mm. to choose the room. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I ended up winning the master bedroom. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so come yeah. along with me, guys. Yeah. I'll be calling home and what a surprise look at that wow yeah and you see <laughs> wow this if is... you know you know if you know you know guys <laughs> if you know you know so basically welcome to my bedroom so this is where I'll be sleeping this is a two bedroom but this is where I'll be sleeping it's beautiful I love it the setting everything is just I don't know what to say it's so perfect you know like the owner of this airbnb is a perfectionist look at the carpet i'm like wow i need to get this for my room because now wow i have a personal space and i can't wait to make it look this beautiful mm. so i love the curtains i love how they blend you see this color is right here and you guys you all know how d loves her beddings white and i can't wait for the house makeover for you to see how my bed will look like as well Beautiful. This is 10 out of 10. I love the bed. It's beautiful because after a long day, you need to have that rest. Personally, I love having a good time on bed. Have enough rest. Okay. Mm -hmm. So we also have the wardrobe. It's right here. It's a sliding uh, doors. And you see the sensor lights. We have extra towels. We have the yoga mat. What else can you ask for? We have the iron. What else can you ask for? Right here, this is the dresser. We have the TV. We have more deco on this side. It's just so beautiful. Mm -hmm. I love it. Everything here is so excellent. Okay. We also have a dressing mirror on this side. And let me know what you think about these outfits of the day. <laughs> yeah, it looks so beautiful. I know. Mm -hmm. I wish I had my clocks on for you guys to see. <laughs> So yeah, that's my room and this is my bathroom guys in here. It looks so beautiful. When it comes to the bathroom, that's where I take most of my time even more than sleeping. So this is the bathroom. This is how it looks like. It's spotless as you guys can see. The sink, like the details, I don't know, but you guys be the judge. All right. So now I want to take you to Kino's bedroom. <laughs> Maybe Kino will take us <laughs> through, okay? Yeah. So well, 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 guys, as you already see on my video, but on the, the task, Elsa and Tail and D, she win, she should choose which room she want to get. So luckily, she's very lucky, you know, she always win when it comes to flipping the coin. So she get the master day. Room. Even the other day in Montego, no, I was not with you. I was no. with Shane in Montego Bay. And you won, I won. I gambled oh. it one. And run away. I know she won again, but I'm really satisfied with my room. I'm so loving in my room. So let's take you into Kino Life in Jamaica room. So guys, look at this. Wow. You know, what what more can you ask for? It's only me, you know, heart and lots of love. That's what I've always been promoting is love, love alone, you know. I got loads of pillow, you know, pillow for my company for the whole day. You know, and I like it. I like this. This is what catch me the most. You know, let's look at this. Beautiful. Beautiful. Smells and nice. Fresh. Heaven. You know, so. I love the curtains too. Mm -hmm. They match with the bed. You know, I like it. And I got also a working wardrobe as well to just like me. You know, mm -hmm. this, uh, this more look like Chinese. Mm -hmm. You know, like in China, when they have them type of closet, same looking where you can see right through. If I lock myself inside. And here again guys <laughs> we have the yeah. ac as well yeah, so we have the ac so unique yeah very unique this is another very unique you know i said if it was me i probably wouldn't go to the store to buy this stuff i probably buy other stuff to put but the idea thinking of out the box you know to get mama africa this is what represent jamaica it's most Africa with D carrying the thing on our head. What do you call this D in your country? Pot. Pot. Ekenyongo. What do you call it? Ekenyongo. 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 <laughs> so this is Ekenyongo. 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 This is, don't let me bite my tongue. 
Uh, but guys, I've been practicing my Swahili, you know, for whenever I'm ready to go to Kenya. So I, I like the idea. So maybe she's really a big fan of you because she's representing for Africa. Yeah, you know, and this is where I come from, guys. Kenya, mm -hmm. you guys, can you see Kenya right there? Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. And I come from the border of Kenya and Tanzania. Ready? So guys, the best part about my room is I've got my bathroom inside my room. So come, take a look. I got the bathroom inside my room. So I don't have to open my door like this to go outside, just in case if she's scared of the dark and don't want to go outside. I can stay in my room and go in my bathroom to shower. And as you can see, very beautiful, you know, the shower. You know the tingle, as we did, I said, you know the tingle. We have lots of towels here, you know, toilet paper for days, you know, face rug, more towels. And everything. everything. The and details. Mirror, everything. And the details, that's what they said. The idea is shells, you know. The Starfish beach. and everything. Look, we get complimentary toothbrushes. So it's like when you're at the resort, when you get the free toothbrush and thing, look, we get free toothbrush. You know, thank them so much. So they and need to book this place as so. They up. need to book this place. We are Ocean Pint, you know, in Lucy and over. Guys, you need to book this place. You know, fam, I'm telling you and this telling you, you need to hurry up and book this place. You know, the link will be in the description and also the contact number. So please, guys, come and book it. You know, you cannot miss, you know. Lovely. If you like. All right, and so go back here again in the bedroom. I like the sheets, you know. I even like this cover. That's like the way Instagrammy, the, boy. Yeah. That's how we say it. Call it Instagrammy. Yeah. So I call it world classy. <laughs> you know, she call it Instagrammy. I Grammy it awards. Word, Grammy awards, with, you know. And the curtain, and everything does match. You know, the carpets, you can see the Ooh, carpets, the, the prints. diamond. You know, everything does color coordinate. Even check the, the frames on the wall, yeah. Everything match the same color that's in the room. Everything represents, you know, it speaks for itself. You know, guys, remember, check it out. And don't forget to check out Kino Life, Life in, in Jamaica. Jamaica. Road to Kino. Kino is, is here. Back. You know, I was running, but now I'm back. <laughs> and I was keeping, you know, I'm back. <laughs> so guys, check out Kino Life in Jamaica. So welcome, welcome, welcome here and over at Lucy Ocean Point. Dream team. Yes, a dream team. One team. Yes, we're back with D now. So guys, that has been it. I feel I feel so good to be here. I hope you too as well. So guys, you need to book this place. If you're coming to Hanover in Lucy, the link is in the description. Feel free to book it and you're gonna thank me later. Mm -hmm. I think even the videos are not is not doing justice. Mm -hmm. This place when you're here, you feel like you are in heaven. So heavenly, so homely, so I don't know, all those good words. So I hope you love the room tour. So see you tomorrow as I take you to the beach, as I take you along, as I carry you along in the community and show you everything. All right. So I'll see you tomorrow and good night. Good night. Calling home, you guys, my guys. When I say Jamaica is beautiful. Jamaica is beautiful and that's what I exactly mean and I mean my words so it looks like it's going to rain today but nothing is going to stop us look at that guys so that's where I'm calling home and this is a gated community in Jamaica like I just don't understand I really don't understand why you know, some people when I tell them I want to live in Jamaica, they're like, no, dear, you can't live in Jamaica alone. Jamaica this, Jamaica that, it's not safe. These are people who left Jamaica like years and years ago. They don't really have an idea of how Jamaica looks like at the moment. And please stop DMing me. I'm so tired of those DMs telling me, yo, dear, Jamaica this, Jamaica that. To me, Jamaica is my paradise. So if it's your hell, that's you. Jamaica is paradise. And that's what I'm trying to tell you guys. If you wanna come to Jamaica, don't think twice. Jamaica is the place. I'm happy, so happy, blessed. Like what else can I ask for? Look at how I'm adding weight, you guys. <laughs> you all see, eh? Looking, y'all. Hmm. I've never been happy the way I am here in Jamaica.
So we are in a gated community. This is how it basically looks. When you talk about gated communities, this is exactly what you're talking about in Jamaica. So welcome to Hanover Parish. You know in Jamaica they have parish. So I don't know which, which number of parish is this. I think my 12th, I don't know. I don't know, I've lost count. So welcome to Hanover. When you talk about gated community in Jamaica, this is exactly what we talk about jamaica is beautiful guys if you're looking to relocate to jamaica watch this video let me show you if you want to live in a gated community this is how they look like and property here is actually not that cheap i don't want to lie like it's very cheap to live in jamaica it's expensive to live in jamaica to me jamaica is a very rich country because yeah, you must have some good money even to own property here so what does that mean jamaica is a rich country people here are rich you see even the type of cars that are outside you can easily tell yeah? Yeah, this is Jamaica guys. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate <laughs> guys. I can't even hide. Yeah. <laughs> this is interesting, but I really appreciate. So some of my subscribers stay here. Okay, and Jamaica, thanks for the love. You guys don't understand. <laughs> I thought nobody knows me here. It's a gated community. <laughs> I'm glad I'm grateful guys Jamaica you mean the world to me I really appreciate I thank you guys Mary thank you so much I feel so good and humbled for the love and support so keep subscribing Wagwan so basically gated communities in Jamaica this is how they look like pretty and beautiful this is just one of them this is just one of them you know there are plenty 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 you know people living life people living life this is where I wanna be people are living life in Jamaica people are living life in Jamaica guys yo look at that look at that look at that so when somebody tells you, yo, Jamaica this, Jamaica that, Jamaica is not safe, don't listen to such people. Those people left Jamaica years and years ago, 60 years, 80 years, 100 years ago. So they're talking about the old days that changed long time ago. So guys, you all can see we have some uh, trash bags here. So the car is coming to pick them. So that's why they are here. Very clean, gated community. Look at the road. Look at how clean it is. <sighs> when somebody tells me D Jamaica is not the best country for you to relocate to me I don't understand I really don't understand and I can't even understand even for a second wow there's a beautiful car there that looks like my brother's car <laughs> I wish I showed you it's a pigeon eh? convertible but I don't want to show you because I don't want to show the number plate okay wow this is beautiful this is Jamaica for you guys. So when you're talking about gated communities in Jamaica, this is exactly what you are referring to. Extremely clean, 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 organized, as you all see. And I wonder how much it could be owning property in a gated community. Huh? I think I need to do research on that. I'll ask my host here. So apparently, guys, Kino, big shout out to Kino Life in Jamaica. Um, he organized with one of our subscriber. She's amazing. She watched both my channel and Kino's channel and she decided to give us a staycation here in Hanover. So after this, I'll show you how the interior looks like and I don't know if you're ready to be blown away. Wow, look at that. Beautiful. Wow, and apparently people are coming home for Christmas now. Wow. Hmm? People are coming for Christmas. It's so big, I don't even think if I'll walk everywhere. But let me just take a walk and show you what it means by gated community in Jamaica. Man, people are living large in Jamaica. People are living big. <laughs> so when somebody tells you Jamaica is not the place, <laughs> I don't know what they really or truly mean. Look at that. Just look at how clean it is. Jamaica is nice. And this is just one, 
one of today's video if you watch my videos to see how Jamaica has beautiful rivers beautiful adventures mother nature mother nature lives in Jamaica trust me it's such a beautiful beautiful extremely beautiful island I think the most beautiful island in the world is Jamaica I've been here and guys what I hate the most is when you guys tell me the Jamaica is not safe and when I say I'm living in Jamaica alone <laughs> It's like I don't know what I said. You guys get angry, get vexed. I don't really even get it. I don't get why you guys normally make me feel like I shouldn't say that. So why should what should I say? I should lie. I'm living with <laughs> with you. <laughs> eh? What should I say? Huh? Imagine how beautiful and safe Jamaica is. Huh? So when I say I'm living in Jamaica by myself. I don't know why you make it like a big deal. Do you want to tell me these people don't live here? Eh? You guys just imagine like Jamaica people are running away from bullets and people are crying. Where do you see that? Where do you see that? Eh? Jamaica is beautiful. Jamaica is, Jamaica is the place. If you've never been here, you're missing a lot. Wow, and it looks like... Hey, the houses I wouldn't even finish because right here I can see house 269. Huh? House 269. So that means. Ooh. Hmm? Wow, you guys. I don't know if you can see the beach on the other side. The beach is right there. <laughs> Somebody wanna accompany me to the beach. Yo. <laughs> Anyways, I don't mind. Let's hear what he has to say. No, I live here in Jamaica. You live here in Jamaica, but you don't sound Jamaican. You know that. Um, oh, you can talk Pato, so you are hiding the Pato. <laughs> Why are you hiding? And the way I love it. That's what I was curious to wait. Yeah, I love it so much. Okay, teach me now. The only word that I know in Pato is teach me. So basically, um, uh, I just visited this area and I'm just excited just to check around. So I'm just taking a walk and uh, showing my friends what gated communities look like in Jamaica. So let me ask you something if you don't mind. How much does it cost to own property here in this gated community, for example? Uh huh. In Jamaican US dollars, and and first of all, do they rent or their people's bought property? Like houses here are bought or they're rented or it's both rented and bought. Yeah, they rented them. Uh huh. They rented them. Uh huh. Airbnb with uh -huh. them as well. Uh huh. The cost of one, is, uh, I think it's twenty-eight million Jamaican. Eh? Eight million Jamaican. Twenty-eight million Jamaican to buy one, yeah. to own it like completely for life. Completely. Wow, they really look beautiful though. And I. Oh, so both three and two bedroom. They look beautiful though. I'm, I'm excited because personally, when I tell my friends, most of my online friends, I want to live in Jamaica, they're like, you crazy. You can't live in Jamaica. Jamaica is this, Jamaica is that, Jamaica is not safe. You're crazy. Then I'm like, people are living life in Jamaica. It's so clean, it's beautiful, everything is here. Jamaica is paradise, but they make it feel like it's hell, and I hate that. But people who say that, these are people who left Jamaica 90, 100 years ago. So they don't really know what they're talking about, you know? Yeah, this is beautiful. This is a gated community. Clean, clean. You can't even see a single paper on the ground. Extremely clean. And to me, it's all about the people. Like, I meet good people everywhere, every single day, you know? Mm-hmm. Okay, we're taking a walk to the beach. Let's see. 28 million to own property here. Wow. For life, right? It's yours. For life. It's yours. What about for rent? A month, roughly? Let's say a two bedroom? I don't, I'm, not, I'm not sure about that part. Mm-hmm. Maybe Airbnb? Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. I'm just loving it. It's lovely. And quiet, and nobody's walking outside. <laughs> I'm the only one in you walking outside. <laughs> people are locked inside eating. <laughs> wow, the beach. Wow. 
which one did I see when I was there? I think I saw behind this. Right? When you're like right there, you see the beach over here. No, you don't see this. You see, I think at the back. I don't know. I'm not so sure. Let's see. Wow, this place is beautiful, guys. Woo, this is the best vacation ever. So remember when you're booking the place, all this is included. As beautiful as it looks. Wow, guys, welcome to Jamaica. Look at that setting. Woo, you guys, my guys. It's beautiful. Wow. It's a good day to be alive today, right, Kina? Yeah. <laughs> so it's the following day. What are we doing? We're having a full day. Uh huh. And shout out to what's her name, Kina? You're the one who connected all these dots. Yeah, but I never think she um, was in our name calling her anything. So oh, okay. The link in the description to book the place. Oh, guys, I love the setting of this area. Wow, this is beautiful. Beautiful girls. Wow. Wow, what do you guys think? Let me know. Hmm, amazing. Hey. <laughs> All right, guys, we're now outside and we are in you know, Lucy. Lucy Town, you know, we're here in Lucy Town, so we'll just plant our feet in another parish. Lovely town. So Lucy come town. along, let's check out how Lucy Town looks like, and don't forget to check out Kino. Life in Jamaica, guys, remember, check me out Kino Life in Jamaica. If you haven't subscribed, what you're waiting and to subscribe yeah. to Kino Life in Jamaica. So come along guys, let's see how Lucy looks like, Parish. Bar. That's the bus park, right? Yeah, bus park, that's the park. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Alright, it's Christmas season, everyone is busy, people selling, others buying. Kino, you already got your, your pillowcases? Which colors did you get? It's what? <laughs> Whoa, fish, 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 fish. Which fish is this, mommy? Bonito. Eh? Bonito. Bonito. Wow. I've never heard it before. It's my first time to see it. Yeah, bonito. Okay. I don't know if in Africa we have this. I don't know. <laughs> I'm from Africa, Kenya. You've ever heard of Af Kenya? Okay, all right. Okay, tilapia fish, Christmas season. Okay, we're starting from Kenya. Kenya, yeah, Africa. This is tuna fish. No, man, this is this is sliced fish. Huh? <laughs> Come on, guys. Let's see what we got. Eyebrows, lashes, done here. Welcome to Jamaica, Lucy. Mm -hmm. 
Right there is Lucy Police Station. Wow, I love the cares. Wow, beautiful. Yeah? <laughs> yeah, Negril going that way. It looks beautiful though. We are so close to Negril. Yes, big up! <laughs> Big up yourself yes, now today. What's up? All good. Yes, I'm both sides. Come on, young man, Gino. You know, some <laughs> wife watch all the while. Tell her thank you so much, yes, and I love her so much, eh? Yeah. You're the best. Okay. Mm -hmm. Respect. Respect, am I right? Yes, okay. that is it. Yeah, so You'll she'll watch this me. and she'll see you. <laughs> God bless. <laughs> we always have time for our subscribers. <laughs> Oh, you want? <laughs> yeah, man, I, I saw a thing, but I video it too much. Okay, I, thank you so much. Yeah, I saw a video, go man. Okay, oh, God bless. Yeah, no, okay. Watching <laughs> something <laughs> good. Mhm. Mm Lucy Methodist Church. There we go. Why are you saying him? Yeah, when we say that, 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 when the girl a chat to me, chat to me, good. They should disrespect me, they carried hood. They carry my belly with piece of sweet hood. They lick her back with a with piece of hard hood. She tell me say that she a whole rabbit hood. She buck up in the man with all of the hood. Me a be rock sweet hood, me hot till a good. Then it's hey, hold it. Oh, oh, feel proud yeah. Oh, my feel loaded. Loaded. Hey. Yeah. Big tune. Get an African tune from Africa. Get an African tune. Yeah. 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 Do me a hunter, 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 hunter. Anyway, me see you get me a feel up front, hunter, 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 hunter. Me coulda never in a me mind be back then, hunter, 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 hunter. Anytime me find on me a feel up front, introduce to me mother and me father. You give me son, girl, and you give me daughter. You're not satisfied, you come back to Grata. What are you getting with holy water? water? This a water where you never get thirsty. <laughs> and every time where you miss me, you <laughs> hurt me. <laughs> and me a boy with all this. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Hold it, hold it. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Hey, be the man a hold it, hold it, hold it. Police lock you up for walk with two in the front, no seat belt or no lights on place. Yeah. What is wrong with you? Yeah. Oh man, me I search for you. Hey. Research. Hey. Yo. Hey. Me want clean search. Hey. Anything you hide with the rest of the animal, me want clean search. Hey. Yeah, yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, you. Show the rod when me a walk in on my toes. You want to search you, I know me a poses. I get off your pants, or your toes. Take a hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey. Yo, Brady, let me tell you something. Right now, no disrespect to the thing. Yeah. Why you see between me and you? Come here, I'm going to show you something. Yeah. You see it, man? I'm a little thing we promote. Put so on something around us and we could bully us up with it. Alright. You don't want to see the color of your dress. No problem. We have the original bad breed Fred Williams. Oh, and I represent that one. Alright, so put on a dress. What drug. is your name, Angel? Mm. Oh, Miss D. That is it. Kino. Original Kino. Me bad. You're bad, man. Bambino. You're bigger <laughs> than Bambino. You're bad, man. Bad man. Yo, the bigger yard, the bigger brother. I mean, the original bad breed. I tell you that. Yeah. 
Me sell money over miners. Me no have no miners. Come me can go in on me searching. Go tell him say. Good morning, Mr. Chin. I have miners and I need this. And I'm Walk out with that one. Yeah. Walk out, make the big dog bark out. out. Let me just start the thing and make it straight out. Yeah, I make it spark out. What make... is wrong with you? Make it spark out. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no, 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 no. What you make soon? All right, then. Let me show you how it goes now. Yeah. See the pum pum there? I make no boy take no body control you. Yeah, you hear me? See the pum pum there? Yeah. Now make no boy take no body control you. Hey! When me pop off me rod of Moses, when me carry on me chooses, girl I give me press and faith and give me noses. Tell me a lot. When me walk with me rod in me chooses, you know I could be in a hunt. I'm a gun, no semi and no one. Oi, hold it. Bad man, me nam pop this. Any girl a road the night, me will all kiss. Cause some girl out the road, them a kiss stick. But I'm a whole lot of <laughs> Pull up, pull up, pull up. I wanna smell some food. Say something, D. Say something, D. Say something. Say something. Say something. DJ, sing something, sing something. We are bad girl and run about a boy like a toad. And we know you can't get the pressure done, you can't afford. Bad girl and run to you. You are full front, and you are not toad. You don't know, say that you know the road code. D, are you saying them a road? Are you big and broad, and broader than board? But you're tough like iron and you're tough like steel You know you know no rice and no corn meal <laughs> Corn flour And I got to see your deal Money night star If you pay the land wheel No money In a bag it a seal We have the money in a plastic Lighten down with white tape and elastic And some boy them are going like them drastic No party boy thing no you not to win business, no. Hello, mommy. Hello. How you doing? Good afternoon, Miss <laughs> Jay. Well, 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 Please, please believe it. You are going to know. Hey guys, good morning. Hope you're all doing well. Welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for always coming back to watch my videos. In case you're new here, welcome. My name is Dee Mwango from Kenya, Mama Africa, and welcome to Jamaica, the land that we all love. So, in case, wow, it's so windy. I don't know if you guys can hear me. Hmm. It's so windy because we're next to the beach. So, in case you're new here, please. Be sure to subscribe, give the video a like, leave a comment, let me know what you think about today's video. And if you are a returning subscriber, thank you so much, you mean the world to me, guys. So apparently, this is where we've been calling home for quite some time. You guys have already seen from the previous video. Big shout out to our host for giving us a chance to have a beautiful staycation in this beautiful place here in Hanover, in Lucy Parish. So, if you're looking for somewhere to have a vacation and you're coming to Lucy or Hanover, be sure to book this place. The link is in the description and thank me later. So, if you're new here, please, please, please subscribe. It's free of charge. Let's get to a half a million. So, this is what a gated community looks like in Jamaica. It's a beautiful place, very clean, very safe. So, for those who are normally be like, Dee, Jamaica is not safe, man. Please keep that to yourself. Jamaica is beautiful. Anything you're thinking of, you'll find it in Jamaica. So finally, it's time for us to say goodbye. And uh, <laughs> so it's time to say goodbye. I'm so, you know, it's a mix of reactions, but I'm so excited because finally I'm going home. You guys you don't understand. Noya feels like home. East or West, home is best. So finally, I'm going home and uh, maybe I want to show Kino. <laughs> maybe I want to take you to my home now. You ready? Yeah. We're going there. <laughs> We're going home. Yeah, so she's going to show me the house up in there. <laughs> the tree? Where? <laughs> yeah. Have you ever been there just once? But you yeah. just checked it out for one minute and went. And then went. So today is the day. Yes. Yeah. Check it 
Toronto. So and I guess, actually, um, uh -huh. I don't cut you. Sorry. So um, you know the house. There's a book here uh -huh. for you to write. Demo and go was here. Oh, know? and also wow. our work mind say key in life in Jamaica, Jamaica was here. there. So you need to write yours as well. Definitely. Too, too, uh, so this is a book for um oh, yes. reviews. Yes. Yeah, so wow. Beautiful. Book for everyone now. I like the book as well too. We had an amazing time here. Yeah, we have amazing time. Thank you so much. And guys, remember check out Kina Life in Jamaica. And remember, if you're watching this video, you haven't booked this Airbnb yet. What are you waiting on? Don't just look it out. Please go and book it out. Right? Yeah. God, trust me, you won't regret it. Yeah. You know, from we telling you that, oh Lord. We are the best plug. We take them to the best places and give best recommendations. Of course. Just like how James place sold out. Yeah. <laughs> this place should sold out. Sold, sold out. out real quick and fast. The only way it's not sold out unless we take the house, put it inside the car and drive away with it, you know, because this house we don't want to leave it, so I'd rather leave with it, you know, <laughs> we don't want to leave without it, so I'd rather take it with us, but I cannot do that, it's going to yeah. be too selfish, you know, so guys, all right, subscribe Kino to Kino Life in Jamaica, link in the description, and guys, let's see the road, but before then, I need to clean my clacks, you know, I yeah. just joined this club Clark. of clacks club, you see what Kino is wearing, Jordan palm feet, <laughs> so I'm wearing slippers, <laughs> Flops, and me, you know? I cannot afford clocks, not yet. <laughs> I just want to wear the slippers on the feet. <laughs> Kino is lying, he has yeah. clocks too. Yeah, but I'm just making fun of it. I'm just so excited to be putting on clocks, you know, because I love Jamaica so much. So, you know what? Yeah, you have clocks, but like clocks for me is like sometimes. You know? <laughs> me, it's clocks. every day, it's every day, I all the know. time. I love clocks, but not love for it every day. Know, me, I'm a big Jamaican girl. I'm more like a sneakers <laughs> guy and a slippers. But you know? me, clocks all the day. Yeah, all this can I need, I, need to, I can't wait to buy some for my dad and young brother. You know, so guys, this is how we do it. You don't know the tingle. This is the best brush for clocks. Not the big one, the small one. And you clean like this. Ooh, 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 ooh. I tell you guys, I love my clocks so much. I need to crush the battery. You know, you know how to make that thing? Eh? Mm -hmm. You don't know? No. I'll teach you, I know. You teach me. Yeah. So I have to wear my clocks clean. Mm -hmm. I can't afford wearing dusty clocks. But they are really comfortable. Like this is one of the most comfortable shoes I've ever worn. So that's basically, I bought them for 30,000 Jamaica. <laughs> yeah, as my Christmas gift, guys. You know, well, this I is the most you. expensive shoe I've ever worn in my life. But well, I told you they're very comfortable. Yeah, they're very comfortable. And woo, I just don't know. And they can go with any outfit, you know. Mm -hmm. And I was told you brush them towards one direction. If it's forward, it's forward. If it's backward, it's backward. Just one. Huh? Just one, right? Yeah. You see? Looks clean now. I love my clocks. The best shoes ever. Let me know if you have clocks too. So anywhere, even in the market, anywhere, I feel like I want to brush them. I just take off my brush, take my time, brush my clocks. Original clocks. from feet mm -hmm. this will last me for the next 10 years without buying any other shoe all right guys that's it now they are clean inside original clocks <laughs> that is it original no fake clocks Mm-hmm. 
Huh. I'm come write your signature. Okay, let's go, guys. Woo, looking so good. Whew. So, guys, time to go. It has been an amazing time staying here. Oh my gosh, I don't know what to say. So apparently guys, as you all know, I don't know what time it is today. Today I have an appointment to the immigration. I need to go there. I have an appointment with the immigration today. I'm supposed to go there, fill up some documents because you guys, if you don't know the Tingo, I came to Jamaica three months ago and uh, I don't know, for some reasons, I just fell in love with this country. I see so much potential. Like to me, it's my dream. You see how many, you see the way other people have like dreams of living in the United States, having a dream to live maybe in England, having a dream to live in Canada. For me, Jamaica is that dream country that I always looked forward to. And I came here, I didn't know that I could spend so much time, I could fall in love with the country. Despite people, you know, like, I don't know what to say. You know, people really, define jamaica in a different way that is not really correct not everybody but some people you know so um there's so much noise at the background let me close the door uh, yeah so guys as i was saying i don't know why but some people make me feel like jamaica is not that place that i'm supposed to like uh leave or call home or something like that due to security reasons and i'm just so tired of this you guys when i say i'm living in jamaica by myself it's like i said i'm living in i don't know what to say like i'm living in a very dangerous country you know i don't know what you guys try to say but i just wish you guys could come here and sit by yourself in jamaica i walk alone i do things alone and i'm not even scared i don't even think oh this or that jamaica is different and um you won't understand unless you come to jamaica and most of the people who tell me that these are people who left jamaica like a hundred years ago eight years ago you know they still have that perspective of oh jamaica is this jamaica is that jamaica is more than what you think trust me when you come here that's when you'll know it the people are so friendly but you guys have seen it all I've never been anywhere where I'm so free to talk to the locals like Jamaica. Even in my own country, it's difficult. Trust me, I can't just walk to the market, say hello to people, create my vlogs and just, you know, just mingle with the locals. And to me, being from Africa here in Jamaica is like being from heaven. You know, the moment I just say hello and uh, from Kenya and all this, they feel so good. Like Jamaica is that one country that they welcome everybody. So personally, it's my personal decision and um and yeah that is it i got a house now and uh, we headed there today i can't wait to take you along the um house transformation it's christmas season and i'm spending christmas in jamaica for the first time personally i don't celebrate christmas because of how i was raised we seventh day adventists we really don't believe in christmas and that doesn't mean we don't believe in god i strongly believe in god but christmas as a day like going all the way out this that for us it's just like a normal day for those who know you know what i mean but this time around because i'm in jamaica they say when you go to rome you do what Romans do. So I'm going to celebrate my Christmas in style. So as we're leaving this place, let me take you along. Uh, if I'm not caught with time, I'll take you along the immigration process, all right? Then uh, if I don't make it today, maybe in the next video, because I have to go there between today and tomorrow. So I'll let you guys know. So wish us a safe drive. My esteemed driver is warming up. The ninja. <laughs> you know, warming up to take on the road, you know where thing goes mm -hmm. from one parish to another. So yeah. you, know, you have to brace yourself, see it built on. So guys, I thank you so much for showing us the love you and know, the support. But and the Kino, support. tell them about like Jamaica being safe. Every day I normally tell you, Kino, I'm so tired of these people telling me Jamaica this, well, Jamaica. You, know, that. Um, you remember even there's a person mm -hmm. who ever called telling mm -hmm. Kino, tell D not to live alone. Tell no. her Jamaica is not safe. And this person called from US or England? Uh, I think it was from US. And what was he saying? Yeah, the same thing what you said, but what can we say, you know? <laughs> well, they were them like them own a life opinion, you know, so maybe they're living like way back, you know, because you know a lot of people they leave Jamaica from years ago. So, mm -hmm. um, but Jamaica, everywhere is bad. Of you course. You know, everywhere is bad. So, mm -hmm. I, I want to know what they're going to say when I go to Africa walking alone. <laughs> 
<laughs> you know what I'm gonna say? Kilo, you're gonna have to tell you know, but what can you say? You know, thank of you course. so much for the heads up, see me, but it's not as bad as what you feel, feel. you know. Mm. You might hear something happen there, but it's not as bad, you know. It happens Jamaica, everywhere, everywhere in the United Jamaica States, is, in Kenya, yeah. everywhere. We're not, we're not saying crime is not in Jamaica, crime is here, crime is everywhere, you of know, course. but it's not as bad like, oh no, if you walk there, this happen and this and that. People that. imagine when they come to Jamaica, mm -hmm. they'll see people running, police running, yeah. looting, children crying. Yeah. It's not like that. I know, because you know, right now the generation of vipers going on with things, you know, but it's not as bad, you know, we still can survive, we still live in CMU, we're still giving thanks. I would thank you know, so much for the prayers and the protection, you know, that's what's helping us along the way, you know, so we put our everything in the almighty hands and we just play our part by being safe you know so we're talking the same way for the heads up i thank you so much for concerning about d and also but we, you know when they tell me know? too much it's not all right yeah so we have to just so like how we know them always gonna talk and tell you those are yeah. then let it just pass by you know we all right for them figure of speech you know i've thanked you know, giving us a heads up so thank you so much you know we thank you for blessing and remember keep praying for us that's all we can say all right guys that is it so we're leaving this beautiful place whoa 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 so it's gonna be a good road trip you know but the good thing about kino he's such a good driver <laughs> because he was driving in england so he follows all the rules After. all everything and he doesn't like over speed so yeah. oh guys look at the beach right there just from where we were staying so if you haven't booked this place yet i don't know what you're waiting for look at that look at that wow you guys amazing so let's hit the road and see you on the other side guys there's a mad accident right here you guys you need to drive well what so guys basically today I'm out and about and uh, today I'm visiting the immigration offices as you all know I have to start processing my permanent residence in Jamaica so being a loyal and uh, being a loyal <laughs> how can I put it and because I love following the rules and the laws of our country because I know that's the only way to go we have to do it the correct way so today I'm visiting the immigration uh, offices and uh, let me take you along the process so with me I have my Kenyan passport and uh, let's go let's see how the tingle goes so I wanna let you know how the whole process is guys okay so stick around till the end of the video i want to let you know how it is so if you're looking forward to relocate to jamaica it's possible okay you just need to follow the laws and the rules of the country so um so basically this is my kenyan passport i'm a kenyan by birth by blood by spirit by everything but as you all know guys everybody has the desire to live in a particular country just like how some of you are watching me and you're now living in the united states working and living there is the same way i prefer to do my thing here in jamaica okay 
So come along, we wanna be going to the immigration offices together. Let's see how it goes. And of course, I'm here with Kino. Life in Jamaica. So bless the love, guys. Don't forget to check out Kino Life in Jamaica. If you haven't, go and subscribe. Yeah. Okay. So basically, I'm here. I got my tickets. So let's see the tingle. Mm -hmm. One. Yeah. Equal rights and justice mm -hmm. stand for all. Yes. Yeah. That is it. Today is a market day. Market One day. Yeah, market Big day. Up. Mm -hmm. <laughs> all right. All right. Thank you so much. I appreciate. Okay. Yeah? Tomorrow, mommy. Okay, so guys, as you all see, Jamaica is safe, Jamaica is beautiful, oh. people are good, they don't even know me, but they are so sweet and nice. So this is how it feels like being in Jamaica, more so as an African, you treated like an empress, people are so good. And it's quite safe, you know, I was telling them, if I was in my country right now, this bag could be into two pieces. Yeah. <laughs> Moso on a market day, no, you have to cut it, you have to carry a bag like this, you know? So Montego Bay is quite safe, you know? Apart from the crazy taxi drivers. <laughs> taxi drivers are something else. Huh? On getting so hot. This store with a fifty. With a fifty. This store with a fifty. Oh, it's Christmas! Flowers everywhere, every corner. Yo. And and what? Curtains and bed sheets. In Jamaica, when it's Christmas, you have to have new bed sheets, pillowcases. That's why you see the market is full of pillowcases and bed sheets because it's Christmas. If you don't do that, for sure you had a bad Christmas. Have a bad Christmas. <laughs> you have to do that. So I also have to buy new bed sheets. You know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The streets are busy selling, buying because it's Christmas season. So we don't know the thing. Hmm? Yeah. You see everywhere bed sheets, pillowcases, huh? Oh, dresser table, huh? It's a must. Hmm. Feels like they have nice stuff. But now I'm checking them out with no money. This looks nice. Really nice. Bed sheets everywhere for Christmas. 100, 100 per piece. 100 per piece. Mm -hmm. huh? Can I hear good? Huh? <laughs> what did she say? Okay, so apparently one piece of pillowcase is 2,500, a piece, a piece, you know, markets, streets, everywhere, active, active, Christmas season, nice t-shirts. Mm. Looks really good. All right, guys, so we keep checking on the streets. It looks like uh, it's going to rain in a few, but uh, let's do this. Let's keep on, let's keep checking on the streets. What happened here? Yo. Alright. 
Hmm?